you nightmare wins. I told you, I enjoy taking all of you out. <laughs> it's not fair! You cheated, nightmare! Yeah, that's not fair, nightmare! You cheated! You always fight dirty! Aw, oh, what's the matter? Are you bitches salty that nightmare has won? I have proven to all you why I'm the best around, but the best part was taking out Psycho. <laughs> I wouldn't be talking if I was you, bitch, because in a 1v1, you'd have dead well in hell. You can't take me out, Nightmare, and the only reason why you took me out is because I was trying to take everyone else out. <laughs> 1v1 me right now. Bitch! Relax, Psycho. It's only a joke. You know you're the boss. But look, fun's over. I need to borrow Scream really quick. Take her back to my room for a little one-on-one -on -one session. <laughs> Wait, did she say she wants to hang out with Scream? Wait a minute, Nightmare. How come she gets to go in your room? We've never even been in your room. Yeah, Ghost has never been in your room either, Nightmare. Relax. It's my job as the co-leader to interrogate and find out about our newest member, Scream. Besides, I want to find out a little bit more about her so she can come in my room if she wants to. Hold on, Nightmare! What are you up to? I haven't even been in your damn room and Scream's going in there! I know you're up to something, Nightmare, and what is it? Tell me right now! Relax, Psycho. I just want to get to know the new girl of the group, Scream. Her powers are very interesting. I just wanted to invite her in my room for a little one-on-one -on -one session. What's wrong with that? You guys act like you can't trust me or something. I'm not going to hurt Scream. I promise. <laughs> What's wrong with Nightmare? Having a little girl time. <laughs> Come on, Scream. Sure! I would love to hang out with you, Nightmare. Scream would love to hang out with you in your room. Excellent, kid. Well, Nightmare wants to hang out with you, too. And we can have a little fun in my room. <laughs> Come along now. Hold it, Nightmare! I'm letting Scream go in your room because she is a part of the haunted horrors. I'm trusting you to find out everything about Scream. I'm watching you, Nightmare! Relax, Psycho. You have nothing to worry about. As my job as the co-leader, I must get to know Scream. It's in our agreement as the haunted horrors. Trust me, you have nothing to worry about. Scream's going to be okay. <laughs> Ghost is confused. Why does Scream get to go in there? I don't know. Nightmare's always been very secretive. She doesn't even let us in her room, nor Psycho. I don't know. I hope Scream will be okay, Agony. Come on, Scream. Right this way. Just keep following Nightmare. <laughs> Where are we going? Where are you taking Scream? I'm excited, Nightmare. Oh, right. We're going into my room. But I thought we can't go in your room. Well, it's your lucky day. We're going to be hanging out in my room, having a little girl one-on-one. -on -one. Oh, Scream loves to have girl one-on-one -on -one time. Yeah, me too. I'm right this way. Not much further, Scream. <laughs> We're about to enter my room. And my room I've never showed Psycho, Agony, or Ghost. You're the first to see my magnificent room. <laughs> Scream is excited. Nightmare, I would love to go in your room and hang out. And maybe Scream can sing you a song. And Scream can talk about everything with you. Of course, that's the idea. Getting to know one another. So, don't be afraid. Come on into the room of Nightmare. <laughs> and here we are. Nice, dark, and scary. What? What happened to the night, Nightmare? What? It's my room. I told you we were going inside. But it's dark and scary. That's the idea. I like scary. Like it? Nice, big, and cozy. Welcome to Nightmare's room, Scream. Nightmare, where are you? <laughs> I'm around. You just can't see me. We're going to talk. Talk about what? Scream? Talk to you about what? You can't hide your secret scream. Nightmare knows everything. Sit down. Relax. Talk to Nightmare. I know you're hiding something. Your true self. Your evil self. 
you're hiding your true power, and Nightmare knows all about it. Scream, and you can't keep it from me. Wait, you know about the Scream? You know everything? I know everything. All the people that picked on you, all the people that made fun of you scream. No, you you know everything about the Scream? You, you know about Scream? It's okay. Sit down. We'll talk about it. That's what I'm here for, to get inside that mind of yours and find out what happened. Tell me, Scream. You don't have to be afraid. Scream remembers. Scream remembers. A long time ago, I remember what happened to Scream and why I am this way. Scream always wanted to be the greatest singer in the world. Scream would love to sing for everyone in the crowd. Yes, so you're a singer. Interesting. And such a beautiful voice you have. And how did you get such a beautiful voice? Scream wanted to sing for the world. Scream sings for everyone. But no one listened. Everyone always made fun of Scream. No one believed in Scream. Everyone made fun of Scream. And they hurt my feelings. Give it up, Scream. You suck. Yeah, she thinks she can sing. Oh my god, listen to her voice. Jeez, she sucks. Ew, get away from us. Scream remembers becoming sad. Scream remembers becoming angry. Wishing to be the greatest singer. Go on. What else happened, Scream? Scream was angry. She wished and wished to be the greatest singer in the world. She cried. I cried and wished that someone could help me. Anyone. I wish that I can have the most beautiful voice in the whole world. Scream wants to be the greatest singer in the world. And then Scream heard a sound and someone appear in the darkness. <laughs> I can fulfill your every desire, your every wish. <laughs> Come. Hello, and who are you? How do you know who I am? And how did you find me? You said you can grant Scream a wish. <laughs> I can grant and fulfill your every wish, my dear. Step closer into the darkness. <laughs> Scream looked at her for the first time. She stood up and she felt so evil and she stared at me she called me to come over to her come come to mirage and i will grant your every desire <laughs> i knew that she was evil but i didn't care scream wanted the best voice in the whole world scream wanted to be the best singer in the whole world and she wanted to help me Poor unfortunate little girl, let Mirage help you. I feel bad, my dear. Let me give you your just rewards. A beautiful singing voice, my dear. <laughs> A killer voice to die for. <laughs> With this song, you'll knock people dead on their feet. <laughs> Just grant your wish, my dear. You wish to have the most beautiful singing voice in the world? Well, Mirage can fulfill that for you, my dear. <laughs> I wish to have the most beautiful singing voice in the world. My voice will be heard because I love to sing and I want to sing for the world. I wish to be the best. <laughs> Let me make that come true, my dear. I will grant your wish for you to have the best singing voice of your life. So you can scream, so you can sing for the world. <laughs> Let Mirage make it better. I hope you enjoy your new voice, my dear. <laughs> Scream!
the world to hear my voice. your powers so you have a scream a voice to kill people such a touching little story there scream but there's something you need to know about me i haven't always been this way i am a dream demon i hop from dreams to dreams terrorizing bitches in their dreams but i haven't always been this way i was once normal a normal girl let me show you who i truly am I wasn't always Nightmare. I was a normal, beautiful girl. This is who I once was. I was once a normal girl, like everyone on the Planet Kingdoms. But this is who I am. A normal, dark, gothic girl. Beautiful. And I love to rock just like you loved to sing. I was an average teenage girl. Dark, gothic, beautiful, and love to rock and roll. I remember, I was always dancing, looking at all the rock and roll girls on TV. But, there was one day I told myself I wanted to go to a special concert. I was walking on my way, going to a special concert. And I had tickets to see one of the favorite people in the whole wide world. I remember walking into the concert. It was dark. The lights were glooming everywhere. People were screaming and yelling. And then I turned my attention and heard the music. I heard the music. And that's, that's when I saw. Oh yeah, baby, are you pumps ready to rock and roll tonight? The crowd was loud. The people were screaming. They loved her. Her music, she was so amazing. Oh yeah, baby, let's fucking rock and roll tonight, baby. The queen of rock and roll has arrived, and I'm gonna fucking tear up this motherfucking building. It was the first time I saw her. She was amazing, beautiful, and she was tearing up the house. Oh <laughs> yeah, baby, let's rock and roll. The queen of rock and roll is gonna tear up the motherfucking building, baby. Cause I live to rock and Rock and roll fans out there, Exotic loves you, baby. And if you live to rock, put your motherfucking hands up because the queen of rock and roll is gonna show you bitches how it's done. Live to rock, baby. Live to rock, baby. That's right. Remember the queen, baby, of rock and fucking roll. Oh, yeah, baby. I know I just rocked this motherfucking house. All right, baby. I need one of my rock and roll fans to come out the audience and rock and roll with Exotic, the true dark evil queen of rock and roll, baby. I want to see what you got, your skills, if you can rock with the queen. Come on, baby. Where are you? Come rock and roll with the queen of rock. I'm looking for someone special, someone who can rock and roll. Hey, how about you, baby? That's right, you in the crowd. Me? Me? You're picking me, Exotic? I didn't actually think she was going to pick me. I love to rock and roll with you, Exotic. Well then, come on down, baby, because you're the next to rock with Exotic. I didn't actually think that Exotic was going to pick me. I was so happy. I walked out of the crowd like it was my lucky day to be on stage with a beautiful rock star like Exotic. I can't believe you picked me, Exotic. Me? Oh yeah, baby, come on up here. What's your name? I'm, I'm Ribbity. I'm your biggest fan. I love you. All right, baby. You ready to rock and roll? Give it up for Ribbity in the motherfucking building, bitches. That's right, bitches. Ribbity's in the fucking building. Now let's rock and roll. After that, me and Exotic were inseparable. We would rock and roll on stage. I gave a good performance. I wanted to impress Exotic. She looked at me, and I looked at her, and I only knew one thing to do, and that was the rock and roll. Like the badass rock and roll bitch that I was, I showed everybody in the crowd, and Sonic loved every freaking second of it. I wanted to impress her. She was filthy sloppy drunk, but I didn't care. I loved Exotic. She was so badass, so beautiful, my idol, on stage, me and her rocking out together. And I loved every freaking single second of it. I wouldn't trade anything in the world to rock out with Exotic. Oh yeah, 
Now, Remedy, you are freaking fantastic. I'd love for you to be a part of my band, baby. Exotic, she, she wanted me to be a part of her rock band. And ever since then, I joined her. And we were inseparable. Everywhere that Exotic went, I went. Remedy, baby, I'm so glad to have you aboard. We have a concert coming up, and it's time to rock. Let's make sure the crowd loves us, baby. You got it, Exotic. I'm going to make sure that the crowd loves us, and they go insane. The queen of rock and roll is here, bitches! And Remedy's in the motherfucking building. Who's ready to rock? The crowd loved us. They loved me and Exotic together. We would always kill the crowd. Remedies in the building, bitches. Put your hands up. Exotic motherfuckers, and we're gonna rock this joint tonight. Isn't that right? That's right, Exotic, and we're gonna show these bitches. It was the best time I had hanging out with Exotic. She was my only friend, my only rock and roll friend. She understood me, but all of that changed, Scream. All of it. What happened? What happened, Nightmare? What happened between you and your friend? Tell Scream! Scream wants to know everything! All of that changed. I was murdered. I was killed by a notorious gothic biker gang that hated Exotic and me. And they took me out to piss her off. No one messes with Exotic's friends! I'm gonna show those punk ass bitches! If it's the last thing I do, no one messes with the queen of rock and roll! Hang on, Remedy! I'm coming and I'm gonna kick those punk ass bitches! I swear it! Exotic heard that I was being jumped in an alleyway by this notorious biker gang. They wanted it out for me and Exotic, so they tried to take me out. But Exotic, she came to my rescue. I know you're here. Come on out, you punk ass bitches, so I can kick your ass. I'm gonna make you pay. That's right, the queen of rock and roll's here, and I'm gonna kick your punk asses. I'm gonna show you why you don't mess with me and my friends. Hang on, Remedy, I'm coming. Exotic, Exotic. Uh, exotic, help me. Uh, uh. It was the first time I seen exotic, and she was fighting them, taking them all out. She was, she was amazing. It was the first time I saw her. She was super strong and super brave. She was fighting like I've never seen anyone fight before. Every kick, every punch. I've never seen exotic fight like this. She had incredible powers until I realized. Exotic wasn't just a regular person. She was a queen. She was a queen. After she was done fighting them, she came to my rescue. I was laying on the ground, dying. Exotic, she came to my rescue and helped me. But it was too late. When she got to me, I was already dead and my soul was gone. No, Remedy, those punk ass bitches took you away from me. My only friend, Remedy. Remedy! I awoke in a place dark, hot. I knew I was dead. I woke up in a place and I knew that my soul, my soul had went to hell. I then, I then saw a woman and she appeared out of the darkness. In a ball of fire, she rose her hand. I knew she was coming for me. I am the gatekeeper of hell. The devil of hell, and I am here to claim your soul, Remedy. I, the gatekeeper, would like to take your soul. My soul? My soul? Please, not my soul. You don't understand. I was killed. I was murdered. I didn't want to be sent here. Please, don't, don't take my soul. She, devil, will take your soul, but I know what happened to you. And that I will fix for you. I will take your soul and make your soul a part of hell. She devil will help you. You're, you're going to help me? You're, you're going to help me? So you're, you're not here for my soul. You're going to give me another chance at life? The devil knows what happened and you are not supposed to be here. I don't want your soul. She devil will help you. I call upon the powers of the demons and the devils of hell to reclaim the soul of Remedy and make her a part of hell. She, she saved me. She didn't want my soul. Matter of fact, she gave me the gift of being something even better. I was Remedy, but I was now changed into Nightmare. <laughs> I was created.
created to be a tree demon. I was half demon and half human. She devil, she she saved my life. <laughs> I had powers beyond my imagination. I was recreated from the pits of hell to be the dream demon. And I dedicated my life to hopping in the dreams and fighting those bitches that killed me and took exotic away from me. I am Nightmare, the dream demon, and your worst nightmare. <laughs> Watch out. 